When flying snakes glide, they undulate in the air. But they also flatten the body from head to vent. The tail doesn't flatten. This flattening creates an unusual cross-sectional shape. We wanted to understand how this shape helps the snake to glide. We used a 3D printer to make a model of the snake's cross-sectional shape. We put the model in a water tunnel at Virginia Tech to directly measure the forces that the snake's shape creates. We also seeded the water with particles to visualize the water motion, from which we could calculate the flow velocities and determine flow patterns. Surprisingly, the snake's cross-section is pretty good at creating aerodynamic forces and is comparable to airfoils that have shapes that are more streamlined. Although this doesn't fully explain how the snake glides, we now understand that its body shape helps to keep the snake aloft.